judge is the absolute ruler of that space. And you can get, you know, 30 days or 60 days of contempt of court for doing anything a judge doesn't like you doing. So uh, if the judge says you can't record in the courtroom, you can't record in the courtroom. Um, and there's no appealing it. There's no uh, mechanism to defend yourself. The judge just says contempt of court and gives you how many days you're going to stay in jail and you go to jail. There, there's no getting away around it and there's no getting a lawyer to face your accuser or none of that. You just go downstairs or across the street to the jail. So do not ever record inside a courtroom. I actually was uh, convicted of contempt of court because I uh, opened up one of those little bloggy cameras and got s smart alecky with a judge. And that's a story that I don't want to tell right now. But basically, I said some stuff the judge didn't want to hear. And the judge um, said I had 30 days to go to jail. You know, I'd be in jail for 30 days. But then after I left, you know, as the doors closed, they said, let him out. The, the judge said, let him out later this afternoon. So I had to sweat for eight hours worrying that I was going to be in jail for a month. But, uh, yeah, you cannot film inside a courtroom, and they will charge you with contempt. Well, and you know? it's not just the courtroom. Uh, they were actually more specific. Uh, they said, yes, Bunny, inside the courthouse in general, not just the courtroom. And here's the deal. The courthouse, you must look up the local laws that apply to that courthouse. And you need to see where does the limit of recording. If it's something like the Eugene Courthouse, all recording is not allowed unless you get prior approval for inside the building itself. So you can't go in and go talk, uh, go and do a records request while recording uh, when you go and talk to the uh, to the um, the court clerk. But let's say I go and do something similar over. Well, I did this over at the Alaska State Courthouse in Anchorage. Where I walked up to the, uh, I stood in line and uh, waited in line to go and request documents from the the court clerks uh, there, and I was recording the entire time. It's because I did my research beforehand and looked up the local rules for that courthouse. Now some courthouses, it only restricts filming within the courtroom itself. Other courthouses, you can't film the interior at all of inside the uh, the courthouse itself. These things vary between the uh, both the federal. And state level and the local level and all that stuff, and um, the local rules. And with the, like the up, what's go, the complicated situation up there in Alaska, with the um, with like the the federal courthouse and the uh, what is it the uh, the visitor center there. That also adds on a whole different issue of complexity within how that's got to be applied. So it, it's just recommend that um, if you want to go and do some coverage of something look up the local rules now if there's local rules restricting uh the ability to record inside the courthouse or inside the courtroom and let's say you want to cover a case well then it's going to be up to you to put in the request to be able to do that and, and just keep that in mind uh, unless sealed most judicial orders are obtainable yes um all look all judicial orders that apply for dealing with uh how things are done within that courthouse are usually publicly available either through documents request or they make it uh, posted somewhere online uh, through their like the city website or through the uh, the county website or something like that or borough website. Um, it's not too hard to usually get that stuff. Now, if you try to make the phone call, hey, I'm looking if there's any uh, local rules that apply to this situation. The clerk, uh, the clerk, they might not be able to answer that question because they might not even know. And I've sort of encountered that issue when inquiring with some of the local courthouses around the area about, hey, I'm just trying to look up the, the, the requirements for filming inside uh, to do courtroom coverage and all that stuff. I was wondering, can you point me out to which, uh, where I might be able to find the law or whatever, where I can look it up? And they're like, oh, you just look it online. And that was their now, answer. Go ahead. i got to weigh in here for a second. Now, if you want to ask permission, that's a different thing. Yeah. Here in Multnomah County... Many times judges will give you permission if you go in and you uh, ask the court clerk and you uh, talk to the bailiff, they'll let you do it. They've let me and Bob record inside courtrooms uh, when we politely walked in and asked. Sometimes they'll say no, sometimes they'll say yes. Yeah, and uh, I mean that's as is when it comes to doing like court reporting and all that stuff. The restrictions on how that trial is covered can be, I mean, fairly stringent depending on the case that's going on. Sometimes they need to they need to clear it with the defendants and stuff like that. And there could be also a dealing with uh, witness protection and stuff like that. There, there might be saying, okay, you can record this, uh, but you'll have to turn off the cameras. You can't record during this kind of thing. 
Um, but uh, that's how it goes. Uh, let's see here. I haven't seen much from Silent Citizen. Is he okay? I talked with him about two weeks ago. I haven't talked with him since. I have. I suspect he's still doing okay. I know he's been busy dealing with a bunch of stuff, so. Let me check the Discord here. Nope, no one over in Discord. The, the pull in, the have talk. Let's see. This channel, uh, this is a channel I could fall asleep to. Oh, that's good. Uh, that's nice, Mr. David. Um, of, of course, uh, how should I put it? Uh, I, I, lis I, I listen to blood sports uh, often to f help me fall asleep. So, internet blood sports. Ah, uh, the drama. The arguing. The debates. The Roy, did somebody just say they're bored? I, no, I don't think it was bored. I think they're just okay, saying yeah. it's a nice it, it's a nice chill thing. Judges like right, this being a nice circuit just to see. And PA are big advocates for cameras in the court, but restrictions, especially in PA, come from due process protections. That is very uh, accurate statement, uh, Dan uh, Daniel there. Trying to figure out Discord. Have not used it before. Uh, uh, Sorgid in your chat. Um, I have, if you're on a computer, I put up a tutorial video on how to do it through a web browser. If you use the app, uh, if you use the computer program on Windows or Mac, it's pretty much the same way as using the Windows. I got uh, another, um, I still got to finish working on the other video there dealing with the mobile app if you're going to try to do it through the mobile. And a as is, it took me, what, a good month to train Mike Blue here to sort of get in here and he's still having difficulty learning the thing. So, I'm stubborn. I don't like to learn new things, but I'm slowly picking it up. Yeah, but um, this is stuff that you're gonna. I, I'm I'm trying to improve Mike Blue Hair, so uh, at some point he will uh, be able to do this. Especially with say I get arrested again, except right. I'm not around. He's gonna be screwed because he's not gonna be able to really properly live stream to all uh, do the entire live stream thing like I do. Well, no, I, mean, I can just do the regular YouTube one, which is boring, but whatever. Yeah. Uh, Kendall Nassar, what is the drama with the Hemming Law Firm? You know what? I'm going to cover... I think I'm going to do a base coverage of that on my uh, drama and live stream channel. So, uh, you guys... Uh, because I think some people are confused about what's going on. It seems to be sort of dying down. And I'm just waiting for... I'm just waiting for all the drama to die down, and I'll do like a, a after coverage you, you know what, kind of thing. Bunny? Yeah. You, you need to educate me a little bit because the only thing I know about that whole thing is what happened on our show. I don't know anything about any of the other stuff.